In this video I'll show you how to make a new footprint for Jetta PCB Designer. It's easiest to start with a, an existing similar footprint because the different parts need to be on specific layers. So uh, if we just close the log window there and we'll pop on the enable visible grid in the view and you can just zoom in using the scroll wheel on the mouse so you can see the points on the grid and just in the new lib there uh, we have various components, I'll pick a simple one, just a carbon resistor and we'll place that down and you need to press escape to come out of the component placement mode and you just highlight the component by clicking on it and then go to buffer cut selection to buffer and then click on the component and then you go back to buffer and you click on break buffer elements into pieces this allows you to edit the footprint so just place one down again press escape again we don't want to place loads of them everywhere and if you look at the side here you notice that the different parts are on different layers there so if we just go to the silk screen layer we'll edit that first I'm just going to highlight that and just delete it using the backspace and I'm going to use a line tool down here and we'll just draw a little positive sign here and the pen will stay stuck to the line after you place the second part, the second point, sorry. So you have to press escape so you can come out of the line. And if you press escape, you can also go back into select mode or you can click an arrow down at the side here and then you can hover over the end points and you can just click and drag the points to change the size of the line there. So just put this negative sign in here. And then press escape again. And there we go, I think that'll do. That's all we need. So just click on one of these vias and press N. So you can input the name. And we'll just call this one one and we'll call this one two. And this uh, will correspond with the name of the pins on your symbol for the schematic editor but if you're just using the footprint in PCB then you don't need to worry too much about that so just highlight the whole thing again go to select and convert selection to element and then you click where you want the centroid to be and it places a little square or a little uh, diamond shape there and that's the point of rotation so put it somewhere sensible and then you just highlight it, select it cut selection to buffer and then save buffer elements I'll we'll just pop it on the desktop and we'll just call it test and just click OK and uh, we don't need this anymore, we can just come out of PCB. Don't need to save it. Oh, there it is. Okay. So there's our uh, there's our new footprint on the desktop there. So we just create a folder to put that in. So it's just Jim's footprints. And now we need to put this folder with the rest of the footprints, which is uh, if you just search for PCB, you should find a folder. Um, it's in the just have a look here. It's in the user share directory normally. You just click on that one, open it up. And inside here you've got the folder M4 which is the old libraries 
they're a different format and then you've got the new lib folder which is the format with which we are using and in here you can see the the other folders for the different sets of footprints so you can't just copy it over because you normally can't edit this file so you'll have to use a terminal to move the folder over and you just type in sudo mv for move a little space and then you can just drag and drop the folder that you want to copy just grab it off the desktop there and it copies the path stops any errors and then just drag and drop the new lib folder as well where you want to copy it to press enter and then just type in your password there we go now we just check it's copied over there so we just close these down and now to check make sure that everything's worked open PCB designer again just close the log window and under new lib there should be there we go Jim's footprints new folder drop that down and there we go there's our new footprint it's a nice preview at the side and you can populate away and pop as many in as you want thanks very much